Welcome to Dell Technologies PowerProtect Data Manager Version 19.x How-To Series. How to restore an Oracle database to an alternate computer. Reference Dell Knowledge Base Article Number 202506. This video was created to demonstrate how to restore an Oracle database to an alternate host. General steps that will be accomplished. 1. Log into PowerProtect Data Manager User Interface. 2. Select a backup to restore, and 3. Restore and recover the backup to an alternate host. This process should be followed when there is a need to restore a database to an alternate host. Before you begin, make sure the Oracle software has already been installed on the alternate host. Make sure the alternate host has the ARM man agent installed and registered with PowerProtect Data Manager. Make sure the point in time restore has been selected with the help of a DBA or just choose the default option. Have PowerProtect Data Manager user interface admin credentials. Log into PowerProtect Data Manager with admin or restore admin credentials. Click on Restore. Click on Assets. Click on Oracle tab. Select the database that needs to be restored. And click on the Restore tab. Select Disaster Recovery and click Next. Select the backup that needs to be restored and click Next. Select Restore to Alternate Host and then look for the alternate host in the table and select it. Click Next. Select Restore to Original Folder and click Next. Enter the new Oracle instance name that will be created on the alternate host and also Oracle Home Directory on the alternate host. And click Next. This section is optional, enter any parameter needed to override or add in the server parameter file, if none is needed then click next. The default is to restore to the more recent transaction discovered by the software. In the example, it is shown the usage of a system change number collected with the help of the DBA. It is recommended to change DBID after recovery. Click next. Select to enable debug to be able to troubleshoot in case there is a problem and click Next. Check the summary page to validate the choices made so far, and if OK, click on Restore. Click on View Details to monitor the restore. Click on the Restore Job ID to monitor the restore until completion. The status column shows, the restore has been, successful. It should be possible to do Oracle database restores, to alternate hosts, after watching this video. Reference the following for more information, KB202506. Thank you for watching.